On this video, I'll be showing you how to download an app for your emails, create an email, and send an email to anyone you like. For example, your future employer. First, you're going to go over to the App Store. And if you're using Android instead of using an iPhone, you would go to the Play Store. Click in the search bar and type in Gmail or your mailing email app of preference. Once you find it, then you're going to click download. And now we're waiting for it to download. Next, you would click on open. After it opens, you'll see something that says sign in. Click on sign in. Then you could choose whatever email it is that you're a part of. If you would like to make a Google account, you can choose Google, for example. Or if you would like to have Office emails be sent to your phone, Office 365, you can click on that. We're going to choose Google. Gmail wants to use Google.com to sign in. This allows the app to sign into the website. So, if you don't have an account, you would click create an account. But if you do have an account, you would just type in your email. We're going to go to create an account. For myself or to manage my business, we're going to choose for myself. My name is going to be Alex the Great. And then you would click next. And then you're going to choose your birthday. And choose your gender. After doing so, you would click next. And then you would choose whatever you want your username to be. And then click next. If the username is already taken, Google will tell you and you have to think of another name. And if you can't think of another name near available right under the text box, you can choose the name they've given for you. I'm going to choose the great Alex 503. And then after choosing a username, click next. Create a strong password. Click next. They're going to ask you if you'd like to add your phone number to have additional Google services. I'm going to click skip. And then you would click next. And you would read over the contract for Google and click I agree. Google would like to send you notifications. It is very helpful to have notifications sent to your phone for the reason if, if uh, an employer emails you, you'll be able to get it right away. But for these purposes, I'm going to click don't allow. But if you would like notifications coming to your phone, you would click allow. Once you click don't allow or allow, it should go to this screen. And it'll tell you that you finished setting up your email account if you would like to send messages to employer, you would press the plus sign at the bottom to, and that is your compose button.
then you would type in the email of the person that you'd like to send it to. Put in your subject. And write whatever you'd like under compose email. Then you would click send. See, is that easy? Easy as one, two, three. We are springing into summer learning at the Chattahoochee Valley Libraries, and the program you just attended is one of the ways you can earn completions. Just go to cvlga.org and look for Spring into Summer Learning. You can register yourself and your family online, and then start reading and attending our online events. That's all you have to do. We're giving away weekly gift certificates, and every completion you make enters you into a grand prize drawing for tablets, games, gifts, and more. Remember, you have to register to win cvlga.org, and we'll see you online again real soon.